And that's really the bottom line. We gotta quit worrying about where everyone else is. This is what I believe. I'm sharing that with you for nothing. Just get out there and succeed. And we gotta quit worrying about, you know, I didn't hit my goals that I made. You gotta quit worrying about all that. I believe that if you put forth as much possible effort as you can put in, then the best result will happen. And whatever that result is, is whatever it is. You can't control it. So I don't think about, I'm gonna make this many calls, I'm gonna get this many listings, I'm gonna close this many deals, and I'm gonna make this much money. I think, I'm gonna grind as hard as I can grind today. I'm gonna sleep good, because I gave it all I had. I'm gonna do it again tomorrow. Whatever comes out the other side is what comes out the other side. You don't really have any control over that, I don't believe. A lot of people think you do have control. But I believe that if you're going for your full potential, as much as you can do, you, you don't know how much you can do until you've done it. Who's to say what that is? And you don't know what it is until you put forth as much effort as possible. You don't know what's gonna come out the other side. If I wake up December 31st with 50 closings instead of 100, which is what I've done since 2014. I've closed two deals a week since 2014, every single week. If I woke up this year, December 31st, 2020, with 20 deals, I would be perfectly okay with that because I'm not tied to the results. I'm tied to what, how much effort did I put in? That's all I care about. And I know that I put in as much effort as I could and I, I yielded the best results possible for my efforts. Just the bottom line. I want you to start thinking about this business differently. And I want you to realize something right now. This business, this game is set up for each and every one of you and every agent in the world to win. It's set up, it's, it, the platform, it, the stage is set for you to win big. We're not at war with Red Fit. We're not at war with Zillow. We're not at war with the other agents in our, in our market. We're not at war with the buyers and sellers. We're only at war with ourselves. Two things that make business, that, that make this business set for you to succeed as much as you want to succeed. Two reasons. One is that it's amazingly abundant. Closings happen every single day. And I think what a lot of agents do when they think about market share, when they think about market share, they're thinking about how many closings happened this year, or how many listings are available, and how many agents are, are in the market. And that's how they're coming up with market share. And they're thinking very limited. See, I'm thinking about 2024. I'm thinking about the relationships I create today that are gonna yield me 10 to 20 deals to me over the life of my career through repeat business, referrals, and referrals of referrals. That's the way I think about the business. So when you think about the business like that, keep in mind, I'm trying to, a lot of speakers, they say, if I could just get through to one person, it's worth it. Not me. I wanna get through to each and every single one of you. And I wanna change the way that you look at the business and realize how huge of an opportunity this is. You cannot talk to every single human in your market ever in your life, never happened. And if you did, you know, it, you'd have to talk to, uh, uh, on top of the fact that you can never talk to everyone, if you really wanted to stay on top of each situation, you'd have to talk to them every five minutes because they're changing their mind every five minutes. They didn't want to sell when you called them, but then they thought about it after you called and then they thought, you know, I think I do want to sell. There's so many dynamics. But the relationships you create today may yield a closing today, or it may be five years from now. We have to build our database so huge and build our personal brand on being hardworking, honest, dependable. And we have to build this brand so incredibly like we're, to, we're in the world of personal branding. When you're, when you're playing the sales game, you're only good as your last sale. But when you build a brand, now people are coming to you because of how well you took care of the, the experience that they had when they, when they did the transaction with you. You made it smooth, you were calm, you handled those little road bumps just right. They loved the way you handled it for them. You handled it for them like as if they were your parents. 
and they, they knew that and they loved that and they'll never ever use another agent and they'll always refer you. And when you build your business like this, not going after the deal, but what can I do to help you and build that brand, you're gonna build something incredible.